Martin, thanks for joining us. A fantastic away performance and result, a win, a clean sheet, you must be chuffed. Yeah, absolutely delighted with the players. They put in a real uh, uh, thoroughly, uh, I thought, deserved victory. Uh, Jamie pulled off one or two good saves and they hit the uh, crossbar once. But overall, I thought it was a very disciplined, well organised, uh, uh, good Barnet performance. You mentioned those saves from Jamie. Apart from that, he had very little to do. The midfield and the defensive boys really mopped everything else up for him. Well, the whole team defended very well, right from the front. As we've seen over the last couple of years, uh, this team has to defend um, everybody. So the defending was right from the front with John Akinde. And then uh, when we had an injury at half-time, Tomo came on and done very, very well for the team. Uh, playing in that number 10 role and closing down their back four stopping any quality forward passes and stopping their attacks being built from the back. And then everybody else, you know, Curtis playing out on the right to help Mauro where they were playing with virtually two wingers and on the other side, two wingers. Gambo done a brilliant job for the team and, and everybody else, you know, has, um, they've worked very hard for it, the players. Very hard for a few weeks now. We've um, not had many days off now and the extra work and the, uh, the attitude of the players has been absolutely spot on. It was just a shame, that bit of a disappointing crew game where we didn't really get a grip of it. Because um, you know, we're out on the road, we've been playing well. You mentioned Ben Tomlinson, probably thought of naturally as an attacking player, but the role he did defensively for the team tonight was really impressive. How pleased were you with what he did? Yeah, well, he's got a great attitude, he's got a great spirit and uh, great enthusiasm. Sometimes you have to reel it in a little bit. But um, he's got great running power, and uh, as we all know, without run, being able to run, you know, you can't really play this game. And uh, playing off John, getting up to support John, and then getting back into helping midfield players. So we had three central midfield players there for the last 20 minutes, and to break away when he could, so the others could all stay in their positions. And he done it extremely well. And um, fair play to him. Last night it was in Sheffield, where he's, I don't think he'll mind me saying. Last night he was up in Sheffield and uh, with his dad who hasn't been very well, so we all wish him well. He drove back from Sheffield early this morning, so to see him out there from half time um, was fair play to him and uh, great credit to him for his personality and his character. It was a really disciplined performance, I think it's fair to say, in terms of picking the moments to attack. You executed the game plan perfectly, I think, right? Is that fair to say? Well, I didn't, the players <laughs> did. You know, it's okay having a game plan. It's okay putting stuff on the training ground and working on stuff uh, yesterday morning and on Sunday morning. But the bottom line is it's the players that deserve the credit. They, they're the ones that go over that white line. And they have to, uh, well, you hope, that they're going to put it into place. And tonight, um, we knew it was going to be tight. We knew their full-backs pushed very high. We know their wide players come inside and are dangerous. And they're very talented. And we knew that when they do that, there's going to be chances for us with John 2v1 at the back. And that's how it worked, that's how it panned out. And when we had those chances, we got up the sides of them and John does what John does. And uh, you know, we're travelling back now to London with three points in the bag. Um, and, and I thought it was deserved, to be fair. With every game that goes on this unbeaten run, the belief and confidence, I'm sure it's never been lacking, but it must, it must grow as well. Yeah, but I think we all realise there's room for improvement. You know, it, um, it was another point on Saturday, and I said there's another clean sheet, another 17 year old make his home debut. But um, that probably is my job to try and pick out the positives uh, because they have got a good attitude. And the lights are going out on us here, probably on purpose. Um, but, you know, I, I still believe there's a lot more to come. You know, there's a lot more to come, and uh, I've got to do more personally. Um, players have got to do more. We all need to improve. And uh, it's a collective effort on and off the field to make it better for the players uh, and, of course, ultimately better for the supporters. I think we'll take that as our cue to finish. Thank you, Martin.